Dare I say, this video is our first ever giveaway. That's right. Stick around. Find out. We still do have a bottle to review for you guys, and this is one that I'm pretty excited about that I had no intentions of finding on my recent hunt, but I was able to grab it. This is Larceny A Batch 123, the first batch of the year, coming in at 125.8 proof. Yeah, I feel like Elijah Craig gets a little more attention, but these Larceny releases I actually prefer. And... Not to mention, Larceny makes my favorite cork pops of all time. Ready for this, people? Ooh, love that. I can really tell it's a barrel proof just on the nose. The nose is so complex. Yeah. <sighs> Lots of cinnamon. Bit of mint. Limestone. Cherry, I feel everybody loved the sea batch from last year. That was like the the best larceny barrel proof that was ever released. Um, however, I like the B batch better last year. Um, my rating would go B C A from last year. And this has a similar smell to B, which I think is very exciting for me. Cherry cough drop. I've mm. got like a vanilla, but it's like a a, a vanilla cake almost, like a mm. really pastry sided vanilla. And a nice oak char. Oak is there. I'm I'm still getting like a really like a, a nice mint sprig. Like a, a mint. Like a really like refreshing smell, which is very intriguing to me. Like a breath mint. Like a breath mint. Well, by the nose, I am very excited. Yeah. Let's go in for a first sip. That is pretty fantastic. That is freaking good. Whew. Takes your breath away. Very sweet. Very complex in oak. Wow. Such a, such a creamy mouthfeel to me. A very like creamy vanilla. Yeah, I would I would almost um how I this is how I describe Weller. Um I would almost mm. describe it silk like a like a layered silk it just lays on your palate so nice yeah i mean talk about smooth oh doesn't even come close right smooth is too rough of a word to describe it that is really good and yeah you might have seen me like freak out and like whoa that was just because that that wasn't proof hitting me that was like flavor explosion like my head didn't even know what to do when i tasted this that's really good. That blows B batch out of the water from last year. Um, you want to see me get a lot of hate from the viewers? Sure. I always described Larceny Barrel Proof as the closest thing to Senor Pappy Van Winkle. Hmm. I know I'm going to get a lot of hate for it, but um, I don't know. I always just I there's something about a barrel proof weeder. Like this, that really pulls in a lot of flavors to me. And I've actually had, like, when we had that Pappy 15 at one time. I don't know if you remember, because that was a crazy night. But um, I went up and I grabbed the Larceny. I believe it was the B522. And comparing the two together, um, of course Pappy 15 is better than this. But this is way easier to find, at least where we're from. Yeah. I can go online and purchase this right now, every day of the week. Not this specific batch, but... And if you're from somewhere where Pappy 15 is easier to find, please let us know. We'll put our phone number in the description <laughs> below. You can call us any time of the night. All right. Don't call me. <laughs> Second sip time. Here we go. Let's refresh our palates with how delicious this is. One of these times these glasses are going to break. This is how we're going to start off 2023. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. Wow. Did they finally did they finally get their stuff together? Yeah. Stop stop the releases. You don't need any more. Yeah. This this is it. Just this make this again. 
Yeah. I don't know what you did, but you did something right. This is really, really good. Yeah. I mean, that is just, that is packed. It is. It's... I mean, I'm getting, like, white chocolate. I'm getting citrus, cherry, vanilla, oak, cinnamon. I... I'm getting vanilla. I'm getting fruits. I'm getting oaks. I'm getting caramels. I'm getting just complexity all around. Um, different noses. I love when noses change. Um, I'm getting a full palette. Top, middle, and back. Um, it's very smooth. It's like, there's no way I would guess that this is 125.8. I would put this more, I mean, oh, yeah. the, the proof is there, but I would put it more at like 100. I would I'd say 100 to 105, somewhere in there. I um, think the only thing giving away the proof is the flavor. And so to have it be incredibly smooth as well, you got to admire that. It's it's really good. Um, if you can find one of these and you know where it is, definitely pick it up for sure. This is one you do not want to miss. And unfortunately, the only bad thing about Larceny Batches is once they're gone, they're gone. They're not coming back. You know, Once they're all balled up and we're all in the B-Batch or the C-Batch and you can't find them anymore, the only place you're going to find them for is secondary big time especially if secondary finds out how good a batch is well let's get the rating let's rate this bottle first before we get into something else this bottle is very complex it's very good nice proof um great price i mean there's not really much bad to say about this bottle at all i really can't think of one however i'm under that motto where there has to be better out there. There has to be. There are so many different... Or I sure hope there is. There has to be better that hasn't been made yet. So I am still not going to give it the perfect 10. I'm going to give it a 9.5. I'm giving it a 10. <laughs> I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. And I feel a little bad about it because it's the first time ever trying it. And I have in the past... There's been one or two bottles where I think it's a 10 the first time and as I revisit it I realize that there was just something about that first sip that really caught my eye and kind of led me there but this it's really good you know I can't help it I I I I in the moment don't blame you for enjoying it, it experiencing it I have to give it a 10 I was going to give it a 10 but then my code of conduct kind of struck me down a little bit. And I well, it's tough to do, right? It's tough to to go out there and say, like, this is perfect. This is 100% perfect, the best. I don't... <laughs> right? That's a tough... It's hard. That's tough to stand by. Yeah. But it's pretty damn close. So I think there's a lot of different whiskeys that probably come in at the 10. I think this is one of them. And I hope that it stays that way. And I hope if you do decide to buy it based on this, that you think the same. Now's the moment you've all been waiting for. Can I get a drum roll, please, sir? Maybe you can add something. I can't, I think I can probably add a drum roll. That would work better than me. Drum roll! We have... Our, for here, you hold one, too. You get the bigger one. We have our first, um, if you if you will, merchandise um, for the channel. Um, these are vinyl stickers, Whiskey Bible. We also have, you know, it's our new logo. Um, so we decided to um, commemorate this event that the first 100 people who subscribe, like, and comment below their favorite whiskey of all time, uh, we will send you a sticker 100% for free. 100% for free. You don't even pay shipping. We'll handle everything. We'll send you a vinyl sticker 100% for free. The question is, is it enough? Do you think, I don't do you think know. It's do you think it's enough? I think we could do a little more. Sorry, I add something else. Okay. Out of those 100 people, we are going to put you guys into a random selector, and one of you, we will give, give 100% for free, a 750 milliliter bottle of Buffalo Trace. How's that? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I feel like we should add something else too. We're gonna yeah, add something probably. else. Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably. So along with the sticker, with the bottle of Buffalo Trace, which is 100% free, and only one of you can win the bottle. 
Um, I actually, we're getting ready to bottle um, a whiskey that I've been aging in my cellar. It's a Buffalo Trace Weeded Mash. Um, I've been aging it for about three months now. Um, it's come out pretty nice. It's come a long way. Um, I'll, I'll throw in a one ounce pour of that too, just so you get to taste what we're tasting here. So all you got to do is like, subscribe, comment, your favorite bourbon below. Um, you'll automatically get a free sticker and be entered in a drawing for that bottle of Buffalo Trace and the sample of the Whiskey Bible bourbon. But free, free, free giveaway. Thank you guys so much for everything and helping us out along our journey. I think I'm Luke. I'm pretty sure I'm Frank. And this is Whiskey Bible. Be sure to stay in school. Ding!